Two months ago, a young green sea turtle named Pearl was found floating on the surface of the water with fishing line tightly wrapped around her flipper. But Pearl was a very little turtle because she was taken right here to the South Carolina Aquarium Sea Turtle Hospital for treatment. We are able to remove that monofilament line, give her some vitamins, antibiotics, fluids, and then have since subsequently been treating her flipper for wounds. Since she arrived at the hospital, Pearl's injuries have been treated with the state-of-the-art technique called cold laser therapy. What that consists of is actually using light waves to help promote healing of that flipper. Now what it'll do is to help promote healing of that flipper as well as hopefully promote new growth of tissue. And now, two months later, San Diego Zoo Kids is back to check on Pearl's progress and see how well she's recovering. Hi Willow, how is Pearl now? Pearl is doing great. I'm so happy to report that her flipper is healing up beautifully. She's using it more. Uh, she's eating really well. She's off of all of her medications, all of her antibiotics. And right now, it's just a matter of rest, relaxation, and good food. How much longer will Pearl be treated here with you at the hospital? Pearl will probably be here for several more months, so she still has a little bit more healing to do. We want to continue to monitor her use of that flipper, and we'll hopefully get her out by the end of the summer. I hear it's lunchtime for her. What are we feeding her today? Pearl loves her veggies, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna feed her about one and a half pounds of different veggies. So we got lettuce, zucchini, cucumber, peppers, really anything that you'd want, she's gonna get it today. Let's go feed her then. Awesome, let's go. In the wild, juvenile green sea turtles are herbivorous, which means they don't eat meat. By the looks of it, Pearl is very happy with what's on the menu today. Seeing Pearl receive the first class care and treatment that she needs to get back out into the ocean again means a lot to me. I can relate with Pearl. We both spend a lot of time receiving treatments and taking different medications to recover and heal. And I know that Pearl is in very good hands here at South Carolina Sea Turtle Hospital and that she will one day return to the sea where she belongs. Mm -hmm.